Hello my guys. I guess I'm gonna do a little review for you guys so you guys can see what I get. This is my little office. It's coming along very well. I went to Amazon and I ordered this Jira Home Night Feed uh, 3 bookshelf. This is something that I need in my office, especially because all my books are laying around and they look awful. Hopefully with this bookshelf, they're gonna look a lot better, nicer. It's gonna be presentable. Let me open it. Let's see what we got. Very well packaged. And this bookshelf is really heavy. So if you have big books, they're gonna be really good in here. All of them they have letters. This is A, B, C, D, F, G, and following the instruction. I don't think it's gonna be really difficult, but probably it's gonna be time consuming. So take your time get this right B on the bottom A on the top I'll put them like this it looks like this one is exposing the big holes on the bottom These two, they're gonna go on B. The screws, they're gonna go inside. On A, I'm gonna put these ones. With the X facing out, like that, we're gonna put them together, and now we can like this in place. Exactly like that. So now they're locked in place, they're not going anywhere. F, we're gonna put them on the bottom. These ones, we're gonna put them on B on the bottom. On F, we're gonna put these screws. that then we're gonna screw this one's in now we're gonna grab G having it with the four holes facing up then we're gonna grab C we're gonna grab it we're gonna put this in the middle ones then we're gonna grab two screws Two A screws. And I'll put it together and put the screws. Just like in the picture, the angle is facing down. This one has angle, it's facing down. We go to this part. Next step is gonna be now we we'll grab D. Same process. We we'll grab a couple C's, put them right here. We we'll grab two screws and 
this one is gonna be with the four holes facing up. Or put it like this. Now that you have this form, you're gonna grab another G and it's gonna be facing the four holes facing out and same process. Now that we have it like this, I'm gonna grab D. This is D, four holes facing up, I'm gonna go right here. Same process. Now that we have it like that, I'm gonna grab another G. On this one, have four holes in it, and four holes facing up, like this. And by now, you know the process. Another D, four holes facing up. Four holes facing up. If everything goes well, the last one that you're gonna get is E. Should be complete now. Next step is gonna be putting them together. I recommend you to do this the same way in the floor uh, because on the last step, you have to put all the screws on the back to secure everything. You have everything in here to put it on the wall. For now, I'm gonna put it together. And this is the reason why you have to make sure that you follow the pictures, all the little holes on the back. That's where the screws, they're gonna go to mount it on the first piece. Now that you have this piece like that, we can put the first piece on top, like this and we can secure we, we can secure both pieces together you have B screws two on the bottom part once you have that the same A screws are gonna be on the back part All the screws are in and if you notice it has one hole in here and one over here this is to put them through the wall because it has a screws on the back it's very very solid it doesn't go anywhere but yes to be secure it has to be mounted in the wall for now I'm gonna put it right there and because it's very secure, I know the books are nothing for it. You can have books, you can have uh, DVDs, games. A lot of people don't use that nowadays, but on your kid's room for the books or on your office, like in my case, it looks beautiful. I hope you like my little review guys on the Jira Home 9 Shelf 3 Bookshelf. Thank you.